you know, founders start their company to build their thing, whatever that is. And they're excited about the thing they're building. But then over time, they're like less and less close to the building of the thing and much closer to and need to be focused on the building of the company. So founders, I'm just thinking like there's two or three founders in particular that I'm thinking of right now who, you know, they get into the, to the, they get into the startup and they start to sort of to disrupt an industry. And someone I just got off, the, off a call with just this afternoon, he's very excited about all the success. They're, they're completely overachieving their success. They're like a series D startup, not, mm-hmm. you know, really growing up, overachieving. And that's fantastic. But over the past few years, this founder has been focused on being an external voice for the company, fundraising when necessary, attracting new executives that they need to be successful, and really has very little to do with the product itself, with the thing they're building itself. And it continues to be a source of grief for him. Like, as in that's why, you know, like that's what he wanted to do. Hmm. And so the company is succeeding and the company is going to achieve his vision. However, his hands are no longer kind of involved. And it's very um, difficult for people to realize that they have to give away their Legos and then to actually give away their Legos. You know, I spoke to Dennis Crowley, the um, founder and former CEO of Foursquare. Mm -hmm. And what he told me in my book was, uh, which I put in my book, was, you know, first you give away the things you don't like. So he gave away operations and that was okay. He didn't really care about the legal stuff. He didn't want to really budget or or learn to make payroll. That wasn't his thing. And then you have to give away the other things like sales and like having no connection anymore to kind of the engineering. And then you have to give away product. And that was his baby. And there's like really sad that he had to give away product to somebody else but that's the Legos you have to give away over time. 